Right here. Yeah. Heading now. We are starting lineup for today. The XL plunger on the short bay. AMN on the short rigger. Ship's got the large bandit over there. It's got our a long gun. In <laughs> and the medium bullet on the long rigger. Watch out. Of course my camera's out of battery. <laughs> I have a, nice. a, bit. I have a video camera in there. That's alright, we got about three cameras rolling. Bit nicer one. Yeah. Fat rat. Happy birthday. Thank you. <laughs> All right, keep winding, keep winding, keep winding. That's it. Ready when you guys are. Right in the roof of the mouth. Right in the roof. Jasmine, bit of fun? <laughs> Alright, bring on the big one.
another one on here. There he is, going ape shit out there. Birthday boy in the chair. Wind hard, Mike. Gotta get that belly out of the line. chair again. Get him. Darkness. Yeah, it was a nice bite, the first one. That's it. Get aggressive. Try and get us really tight. I want to see a bend in that rod. There we go. Couple more, Mike. Couple more, mate. That's it. Good work. Yes. Whoa. See that coming. It's all right. Yep. Good. Good. Could see him winding up there. <laughs> Yeah. Made me catch the last fish of the day twice. Put the drag up now. Now that it's caught. Keep going, keep going. That's alright. Nice. Oh yes. Oh wait there. <laughs> I thought he was on for a second. Good stuff. Congratulations, great day. Good 
Happy John. birthday, Mike. Not bad. <laughs> Happy birthday. Happy birthday, buddy. Hell of a day. Yeah, that was Thanks, a beauty. Man. Good stuff, Thank man. You. Well done. Congrats. Thank that was so awesome. Much, well done. So I've been posting these bike videos on my Instagram story on my Tantrum Nick page and um, got a lot of messages from guys asking specifically why we're in such a hurry to back the drag off right after the bite. The reason is we run about 35 pounds of drag on the bite, a little bit over 15 kilos, 15, 16 kilos, which is quite a bit really. Um, and here in Kona, we can see fish anywhere from 50 pounds to unlimited size and that heavy drag on the bite is more geared towards bigger fish so when we get a smaller fish eat the lure with that amount of drag obviously it's not a bad thing that it's punching that hook in and driving it in but if it's just barely hooked you can backflip the fish and it'll come off pretty quick I mean if it's hooked it's hooked it doesn't matter what you do but um, with a fish that's just barely hooked um, a small fish, pretty important to, to back the drag off quickly. So we've got three tape marks um, on our reels for our drag settings. The white tape mark is 35 pounds and we've got a blue tape mark which is probably about 25 pounds and then we've got a red tape mark which is our oh shit mark for when we get a really big one smoking us. So that's a mark that you don't want to come back any further to avoid a, a backlash of the reel. So it's just above free spool. So generally speaking, we'll back it off from that white tape mark to the blue tape mark as quick as possible. On the third fish that we caught on this particular day, you'll notice that I'd back the drag off even further, um, almost to just above free spool. Now the reason for that was the fish was jumping straight back towards us and at first you see me take a couple of cranks just to stay tight, but the fact that the fish kept coming at us um, meant that we would have been pulling on it from front on, which is usually not a good scenario. Um, so what I did um, by backing the drag off even further was I introduced a belly into the line so that the angle of pull was still coming from behind the fish, even though the fish was jumping right at us. So by backing the drag off like that, you can introduce that belly, therefore the angle of pull is coming from behind the fish, which is a more ideal situation. On a stand-up, outfit I've even seen guys leave the drag where it is and almost drop the rod tip into the water to try and create that belly in that scenario so it's a pretty useful little uh, little trick that seems to work really well um, if you guys want me to go into any more detail about the the drag settings we use and and how we use them um, more than happy to go into that on a on a future episode so just let me know in the comments below or shoot me a message and um, would be more than happy to cover that for you guys if you're interested. Anyway, that was a really fun day with Mike and Jasmine. Ended up three for five that day. Um, no real big fish, probably the largest one was 250 pounds or something like that. So a little bit above average for the summertime rats. But um, yeah, looking forward to our next nice one. Um, all three fish that day were on an all black AMN rigged with the uh, Tantrum X Fudo Tenno. That lure has been really good to us lately. We've we've come to know it as the Dark Knight. So yeah, look out for that. Hanging out the mouth of a nice one soon, I suspect. Um, not a lot of days at the moment with the whole COVID situation, but trying to make the most of the ones we've got. So got a couple days coming up with Ed, the owner. So really looking forward to that, and um, hopefully have an episode for you guys soon. Um, yeah.